on the outside, they look well, but everything's brewing inside. My husband and I have fostered and adopted seven children. They are all special needs adoptions. Mary Davis, the cafeteria manager at Antioch Middle School, says all of her children had difficulty in school and life. And even teachers can see them as just a problem child or a troubled child. Mm -hmm. And uh, that's where in middle school we ran into Jan Burgess in her program over there that has just been a godsend for my boys. How are you today? Good. Jan Burgess is a special education teacher at Northgate Middle School. What's your goal for today? She sees past the behaviors and sees what's inside. You want to come up here for lunch with me today? For 37 years, Jan has been the student's number one advocate. Today we're going to do a special activity on following directions. When students weren't progressing, we kind of stirred things up and became kind of a model classroom for the district working to move them into mainstream classrooms instead of teaching them in isolation. The change? Remarkable. They were different kids and, and they started to just be um, kids instead of stigmatized and, and isolated. They became uh, a part of the school community and I'm all about the school culture and making sure everybody feels like they belong and so it was, it was pretty, pretty phenomenal. Mary says Jan's impact on her son Thomas was amazing. Thomas came in as a surly, um, angry, non-responsive uh, kid and left here being a tutor for other kids and making tremendous progress. I have had seven children that have gone through the, through the district. She has saved many of their lives <laughs> and mine too. <laughs> and that is why Jan loves her work. My heart's gonna pound out of my chest. It's just makes me cry, uh, you know, that that they just made it. We have our kids have so many strikes against them. So, uh, gosh, the li the lives that they live, and uh, just to see them do that just makes me. I'm just filled with wonder. While this is Jan's last year of teaching, we've been able to make some significant changes. I think North Kansas City is is by far. Uh, one of the best districts that I know of, and I'm, I'm really proud to be working for it. It's very okay. special. Okay. She hopes to continue her passion, helping children with special needs. It makes all that effort, you know, that, that hard work, that, you know, wrenching pain of seeing kids go through these things, it just makes it so worthwhile. I mean, it just keeps you going for 37 years. <laughs> Love you.